slide, splash, and swim. The unofficial start to summer is Memorial Day this weekend. Many will head to the water to cool off. Before you jump in, the general manager of Big Kahuna's, Bob Cordier, has some things you need to know. Come in clean because there's a lot of nasty stuff out there. And, and, uh, and if you are not careful, we can hurt a lot of people. The CDC says thousands of Americans get sick from germs found in water, like in pools or even the Gulf. Dr. John Lanza with the Escambia County Health Department preaches prevention. Water, water, water. It's always good. But I mean water that you bring with you, not water that is in the river, the lake, or the gulf. You don't really need to be drinking that at all. That can cause certain problems, lead to skin issues, diarrheal diseases, those sort of things. He says children under the age of four can dehydrate very quickly. So give them drinking water about every 15 minutes. And make sure that they've hydrated themselves before they go into the water and when they each time they come out of the water, but also that they have a waterproof sunblock uh, on. He recommends using a sunblock with an SPF 15 and above. We're here to have, let you have a good time, but we're here to make sure you're safe doing it. At the park, there are about 100 lifeguards on duty at all times. They're maintained at a very high level, CPR, rescue breathing, uh, uh, all the different aspects of making sure that if, if in the event of emergency, we're ready to go. Lifeguards at Big Kahunas look like they're shaking their head up and down, but they're not. They're actually shaking their head in a grid pattern looking for people who are in distress. Your zone starts over here, you move your head, you cover your zone, ends over here, and you go back. It's like a typewriter. And don't even try to talk to him. Hello, sir. Excuse me. He's on duty. Dr. Lanza recommends always staying within an arm's length of your child. He and lifeguards agree. Teaching children to swim at an early age is essential in their water safety. Everybody should learn to swim. If you've got any ability or any means, get your kids to school, get them to the location, get them to swim because uh, it's, it's sad to hear people having accidents because they don't know how to swim. For more health and safety tips, go to our website, WEARTV.com. Ricky Van, Channel 3 News.